Hi guys, welcome to my new tutorial. In this tutorial, I am gonna show how to make this animation with After Effects. Let's begin. So, vectors from freepik.com, I will add down a link and project files. Let's select this character, select all these layers, and right mouse, precoms, add precoms name, character, and click OK. Then, open character composition and select this hand go to palm behind and move to anchor point to down okay then select this hand to one go to solo and select anchor point move to here okay and click selection tool for exit this function and unhide okay nice then select hand one Parent to hand two. Let's select hand two. Press air in the keyboard and change rotation. Okay, not bad. Then select umbrella and parent to hand one. Okay, and select this hand one. Press air. Let's see how to work it. Okay, not bad. And select this hair back. Move to back to body. Nice. And select this head, go to solo, select anchor point, move to dome. Nice. And on solo. Okay. Select this body, go to solo, again, palm behind, and move to anchor point here. Okay. Character rig is done. Let's make loop animation. Select this hand tool, press air in the keyboard, and change rotation make new keyframe go to two second and change rotation like this select this keyframe move to here and select this all keyframes right mouse keyframe assistant easy is and go to graph editor make smooth graph let's say again okay and go to 2 second, make new keyframe and go to 3 second, change rotation 1. Let's see. Okay, nice. And go to 4 second, make again new keyframe, go to 5 second and change rotation. Let's see again. Okay, not bad. Let's select these keyframes, move to left, and select this keyframe, move to left for speedly keyframe animation, and select these keyframes, move to left. Okay. Nice. Then select hand two, press P in the keyboard, make new position keyframe, go to here and move to down. Okay. And in this time, make new keyframe, go to here, and move to down. Okay, then in this time, make new keyframe, go to here, and select first keyframe, Control c Control v for loop animation. Select all these position keyframes, right mouse, keyframe assistant, easy is. And press N for work area. And press 0 in the keyboard for play this animation. Okay, not bad. Right mouse and come to work area. Then select this here, press air, make new keyframe, and change rotation. Go to here and change rotation again to maybe 4. Okay. And go to here, make new keyframe, go to these keyframes and change to zero. And select all keyframes, right mouse, keyframe assistant, easy is. And let's see. Okay, not bad. And go to here, make new keyframe, and go to last keyframe. Select first keyframe, Ctrl C, Ctrl V. Okay, not bad. Again, select this head, 
hold shift and press P, open position and make new keyframe, go to the center, move to down and go to here, select first keyframe, Control C, Control V. Select all keyframes, right mouse, keyframe ascent, easy is. These keyframes for bones animation, let's see, nice. Select this position keyframes, Control C and go to here, Control V and hold Alt, move to left. Okay, let's see. Nice. And go to here, last keyframes, Control V and move to left, hold Alt and change positions. Move to left again. Let's see. Okay, not bad. Then select this head, hand to parent to body. And select body, press air, make new rotation keyframe, go to here and change to. Okay. Select keyframes, move to right. Okay, then select this hair back, parent to head. Let's see again. Okay. And make new keyframe in this time. Go to here. Select first keyframe. Control C, Control V. Let's see. Okay. Select all keyframes. Right mouse, keyframe ascent, easy is. Okay. In this time, again make new keyframe and select this first keyframes. Control C, Control V. So not bad. Then select body, hold shift and press P. Go to here, make new position keyframe. Go to center and move to down. Let's see. And select first keyframe, Control C, Control V. Again bones effect. And select this position keyframes. Right mouse, keyframe ascent, easy is. And select these keyframes, Control C. Go to here, Control V. Okay, let's see. Okay, select this center keyframe, move to up. Okay, and this, again move to up. Okay, select this keyframe, Control C. And go to here, Control V. Again, Control V. So, this is loop animation is done. Let's see full animation. Okay, body animation is very speedly. Let's select body. Press U for see all keyframes. And select this position keyframes. Hold Alt and move to right. Let's see. Okay, and change rotation. Okay, not bad. Again, select this, move to right, and change positions. And this. Let's see. Okay, not bad. Then select this hand one, press air, and select this hand. Press U for CK frames. Make new rotation for this hand one. Go to here and change rotation. And in this time, change again two and three or four. Let's see. Okay, select this keyframes, right mouse, keyframe as easy is. Select this keyframes, move to left. Okay. And in this time, make new keyframe for hand one. Go to here and change rotation to zero. Okay. In this time, again, make new keyframe. Go to here and select first keyframe, Control C, Control V for loop animation. Let's see. Okay, not bad. I like it. Let's close this character and make rim. Right mouse, new and adjustment layer, add name, rim, and go to effects presets. Let's search 
CC rain fail. Select this rain fail, move to this rain. Okay, this is default animation presets from After Effects, and we can change size. Okay, and drops and speed. Let's say again. Okay. So, not bad. Let's change wind. Okay, not bad. Let's make water drop. Right mouse, new and adjustment layer. Change name, water drop. And go to effect presets, search CC drizzle. And select this effect, CC drizzle. Let's use water drop. Okay, nice. Then make thread layer with this icon and change quality to quarter and press air change x rotation okay move to down nice and change rate okay change ripple hike Okay, let's see. Okay, not bad. Then let's animate these waters. Open waters composition and select all these waters. Press S, open scale. Go to 6 second. Make new keyframe and go to first second. Change scale to 18 let's see or 70 nice let's see okay not bad let's close waters and no let's animate this tree select this object go to solo and search effect cc bandit and select this CC Bender. Let's use this layer. Okay. And make new amount keyframe. Press U for C keyframes. Go to one second. Change amount. And go to three second. Change again amount. Okay, and go to 5 second. Select this first keyframe, Ctrl C, Ctrl V. And select these keyframes, right mouse, keyframe as easy is. And let's change work area. Right mouse, come to work area. Okay, let's see. So, let's unsolo. Select this CC Bender. Ctrl C and select this object, Ctrl V. Let's see. Okay. And this object, Ctrl V. Okay. And this object, Ctrl V. Okay. Then let's select this solo and go to Palm Behind. Move to anchor point here and select this. Move to anchor point here and this. And this. Okay, then select this object, press air, make new rotation keyframe, go to 10 keyframe and change rotation. Again, go to 10 keyframe. Select first keyframe. Control C, Control V. Let's see. Okay, select these keyframes. Right mouse, keyframe as easy is. Okay, select these keyframes. Control C and Control V for loop animation. 
Let's say again. Okay, not bad. I like it. Select this rotation keyframe, control C, and select these other objects, control V. Let's see. Okay, nice. Not bad. Select these objects, parent to main tree, and select this main tree, go to solo, pump the hand, move to anchor point here. Okay, and press air, make rotation keyframe. Go to here and change to okay and go to here change again zero select these keyframes hold alt and move to left select again keyframes control c and control v then select rotations right mouse keyframe as an easy let's say again okay nice Okay, this tree is done. Let's animate it, this light. Let's create new solid. Change color to yellow. And click OK. Again, add name, light. And click OK. Then, go to here and ellipse tool. Make circle. Okay. Move to here. Open this mask one change feather okay nice then let's create again new solid add name light light to click ok and go to pen tool make this object move to here okay like this and open mask change feather and max expenser okay press t change opacity then select this light 2 and light 1 press t make new keyframe go to 10 keyframes and change to 10 And go to again 10 keyframe, select these first keyframes, Ctrl C, Ctrl V, and Ctrl C, Ctrl V. And select all keyframes, right mouse, keyframe as easy is. Let's see. Okay, select these keyframes, hold Alt and move to left. Okay, like this. In this time, again select this keyframe, Ctrl V, Ctrl C, Ctrl V, Ctrl C, and this. Let's say again. Okay, not bad. So, select this background three, press P, make new keyframe, go to last second and move to down. Okay, and background two, press P, make new position keyframe, go to last second, move to down. Okay, and select this city, press P, make again position keyframe go to last second and move to down okay and select this city move to back then let's make fake camera create new null object and select this all layers without this four layers select this all layers parent to this null object and press S, make new scale keyframe. Go to here, change scale. Let's see. Okay, nice. I like it. So, thank you for watching my tutorial. And don't forget to like video, subscribe channel, and follow me on Instagram. Good luck.